Hello class, in this video I'm going to do exercise 4.17. This exercise asks you to use Boole to construct a joint truth table, a truth table for a pair of sentences. We also want you to understand what those truth tables show, so to be able to evaluate or assess the truth table. So this exercise asks you to make sure to evaluate it as equivalent. What that means is the truth table proves the two sentences are tautologically equivalent because they have the same truth uh, value on every single row. 4.17 uh, is about a distribution law. So if we have a conjunction, wide scope around a disjunction, we can distribute the first conjunct onto those uh, bits in the disjunction. So treat the A and as one chunk, first put it on the B and then put it on the C. And that's why we get A and B here and A and C here. And then this disjunction drops down as your new main connective. Let's prove that these things are equivalent. In Boole, then, to do this exercise, what you have to do is build a joint truth table. You can't put a connective between these sentences or something like that. You need to actually use this button to create two independent sentences in your truth table, or you can use the keyboard shortcuts. Uh, I filled out the reference columns in canonical notation already, so I just need to start filling out the truth table. Let's start with the B or C part, because that's the innermost part. That's true on the first three rows because of the T's on the B here and this T on the C here. Uh, similarly, it's going to be true, 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 false on the bottom half of this table. All right, now we can compute the conjunction. So this is going to be true at the top. It's going to be false here because the B or C part is false, and then it's going to be false all the way down because the A part is false. All right, so there's our truth function for the first sentence. Uh, notice my uh, values are slightly off here because I was increasing the size to make this easier to read. Here, that's a little bit better. Uh, so here, let's compute the A and B part. So here's true, true. Now it's false is all the way down. That's just my conjunction of A and B. Now my conjunction of A and C, it's going to be true, false, true, false. Same number of T's, but just in a different order. Uh, now let's disjoin these things. So we're going to get true on the first row. Oh, excuse me, true on the second row, true on the third row, and false all the way down. All right, hey, look, these two columns grade in. The main connectors of each sentence are the exact same. So they're totologically equivalent. So let's just say, hey, they are totologically equivalent. Uh, and now we're done. Let's check out our table. Great. Let's submit this to Grade Grinder, and then we would have 4.17 done. Okay. Thanks.